Hey, today we're uh, going to do a demonstration of Wii Linux. It's uh, a version of Debian called XSuite. It has a uh, working X server. You can run a web browser. Almost any application uh, on Debian that's been that's, uh, been ported to PowerPC. The package manager uh, works. AppGet works. So it's really uh, easy to install applications. If you have more complicated ones, though, sometimes uh, they they have little issues with uh, the the instruction set of the processor. So what I just did is uh, went to uh, what's it called? Boot me. I w you can boot straight into the uh, the uh, Linux, but I did it through the uh, Wii menu, so you'd see what I was doing. It's just a boot me boots the kernel. Uh, in uh, in boot me's mode, I can't remember what it is, but uh, that gives it more access to the hardware. Okay, so as you can see, it's starting up now. Um, the uh, it's an RCA video output, so it has some issues with uh, horizontal lines and text and stuff like that, which you can see. And uh, when you have the actual uh, 60 frames per second, it it does look a lot better because they sort of blend in the letters. Okay, so Python, as you can see, works. Uh, I think this is uh, Openbox Window Manager, I'm not sure. But yeah, Python, it's really old version of Python. I think this is like Debian Etch or something. I haven't got the chance to upgrade it yet because uh, my Ethernet adapter has been reallocated and the Wi-Fi drivers aren't working on XSuite at the moment. You can get them working on Wheat but uh, I haven't managed to get them working on XSuite yet. And I, if I can get internet versus X, I, I go for X. So uh, this is me failing to use Python. I'm trying to demonstrate this here. It didn't work out too well. Okay, so uh, there's a lot of different stuff on here. Like uh, you can get a terminal, obviously. This is just a standard X term. Uh, the X up at the top top right is flashing. Uh, I'm not sure how that works. It's some sort of a, a thing. Okay, so the processor is 729 megahertz. It's slow, but it works actually. It's uh, it's actually very usable. There are 78 megabytes of memory in in uh, currently usable in this system. As you can see, system is under relatively light load, considering what it's being used for. Uh, yeah, 78 megabytes of memory. That's pretty bad. I'm surprised it can run Super Mario Galaxy with graphics like that. I'm not sure if uh, 3D acceleration works on here. I've actually gotten Blender working on here. It rendered really slowly, though. See, this is a web browser. I can't actually show you any internet sites because it, the uh, the Wi-Fi drivers are broken, as I said. But uh, they can work. I just haven't set them up. So it's very responsive overall. You, the the open box window manager can be replaced, but uh, it's it's very nice to work with. I'm currently using the uh, Wii Mote as a mouse, so you can just point it, point and click, uh, just like you can on the Wii menu, and it's it's pretty easy to use like that. You can also uh, reconfigure uh, open box to look differently. Kind of pointless, but funny. So uh, I'm just going to shut it down now. Overall, it's it's a really nice system. Uh, it's, as I said, very responsive. It can run Blender. It can run GIMP. It can run just about anything. So uh, you can get this. Oh, I, I don't know where. I think you, if you check on uh, the GC Linux site or uh, Hack Me no, or Webrew, you can get it there. Uh, so it doesn't really print much as it's shutting down sometimes. If you reboot, it'll uh, print in it and stuff. Well, that's it. Thank you for watching. Bye.